Good morning, sleevers. It's me, uh, Laura's DSG Tube. Um, I actually had a couple emails about my makeup, and I've never um, thought about doing a YouTube video on makeup because this is a sleeve channel. Um, so I will show you how I do my makeup real fast. Enjoy. Um, so a couple things this week, uh, high weight 207, surgery weight 194, you guys probably know those by me by now, but, um, I was 156.4 this morning. This is my 16 weeks, my memory is so bad when it comes to the week, but I'm 90% positive it's week 16, um, which puts me at like my four month mark. Um, a couple things that happened this week, I put on a size 7 pants in a store and I was like super excited about it because I haven't been a size 7 since I was 7 years old so I was like crazy excited about it um, and then I got home and I was like oh it's vanity sizing because I have a pair of size 9's that I had in um, high school that were express jeans I think in high school um, but they're like my skinny jeans and I know everyone has like a pair of skinny jeans like laying around and they're my size 9 express skinny jeans that I wore in high school that was like when I was at my smallest point I've ever been in my life um, and they weren't even like close to buttoning and I was like man society got me again. I was all excited about wearing size 7 and if I'm being honest with myself I don't think size 7. My 11s are getting baggy so I went to the store to get some size 9s for when these got a style and if you guys have Deb across the country I don't know if it's like a Michigan thing um, but like Deb all the stores are closing and I'm like so bummed because that's like my favorite store to get my pants and my clothes at so I was like okay well I gotta go to Deb and I might as well get some 9s and maybe some 7s if I get that far um, while I'm uh, I forgot to take my nail polish off it's so bad um, I was going to get some nines because my 11s were starting to get baggy. I don't want the store to close and then have to pay like more for pants somewhere else. Um, so I was with my husband and I was like, grab me a size 9. And I put the size 9s on and then um, they were like kind of baggy. And I was like, grab me 7s. And I was like floored. And I was like in the dressing room like, do I wear a size 7? And so I put them on and they buttoned and I was like, oh my god, these are 7s. And I was all excited until... The truth came out at home that that was probably like realistically a size 9 or like a size 11. And it's just vanity sizing and it was marked as 7s, but whatever. Um, that was kind of exciting for me. I got drunk. For real. Um, so it was the uh, basketball game. I took my friend Chrissy and my husband too. And then I had vodka and sugar free Red Bull at the game. And then I had another one. And they were doubles. Um, and then we went to a bar after, and I had one more, and I was drunk. Um, but I was, like, saying that I wasn't drunk. But then, like, and I've never, like, forgotten stuff from my, when I was drinking ever. I've never been a blackout drunk ever in my life. Um, and the next morning, Chrissy, because she's not been at my house, she was like, you want to go to Speedway and get one of those uh, sausage, egg, and cheese things? And I was like, oh, I love those things. And she's like, yeah, we know. You didn't shut up about it last night. I was like, what? And she's like, yeah, you told us you were, like, addicted to them and you couldn't live without them. I was like, did I? And my husband's like, yeah, you said that. And I'm like, I don't remember saying that. And I'm not addicted to them. I like them. But, like, <laughs> um, but whatever. Uh, that was kind of funny. But, I mean, all is well. I wasn't, like, hungover or anything. I was just, like, surprised that I was that drunk. I didn't think I was that drunk. I will say, positive note, I'm very happy that I'm not losing, like, my boobs in this whole process. Like, hi ladies, I love you. Please don't go anywhere. Cause I really like my boobs. I'm all over the place in this video. 
Um, I did have a moment this week where my husband was watching sports, and I don't care anything about sports whatsoever. I hate them, um, except for Red Wings hockey. I will watch hockey. But anyways, um, so I was in the bathroom, and I was, like, staring at myself in the mirror for a while, which is just, like, the epitome of vain. But, like, what it was was, like, my collarbones and, like, my, my bones. Like, I've never really seen them that pronounced before. I thought that was kind of cool. So I was like kind of staring and like checking myself out for a hot minute. And that's a cool little moment for me. I've been ecstatic this whole week since I broke like the 158, 157.8, 158.2 stall. Like that was driving me crazy. So the fact that I'm like 156.4 to 156.8 like this week it's kind of been going. I did see 155.8 one time this week um, but I'm not counting it because I don't want to get my hopes up, um, but I'm okay with being 156 point whatever. Um, I just really want to get out of the 158 zone. Um, total weight loss is like 51 pounds in 16 weeks. Uh, shout out to Dr. Ramos Kelly. My life is like mine again, and I'm starting to feel like Laura again, and it's great. And there's nothing I would have paid double for this. Like it's. I'm so thankful for the surgery, like, so, so thankful. Um, I have a Commodore's ball coming up. I get to wear a fancy dress, which I got on RentTheRunway.com, um, which is probably going to be my new favorite thing, because really, if you have, like, a ball that you're going to, like, you're going to wear the dress one time. You're going to go spend 200 bucks on a dress at JCPenney or Macy's or wherever you go, and then you're not going to wear it for the next event you have. You're just going to you know, buy another one the next time. So, instead of, like, spending 200 bucks, my hair looks cute. I'm such a ditz. <laughs> but you can really see, like, the red that I put in it from this angle, and I like it. Um, but anyways, so, renttherunway.com, they gave me, I picked out a Nicole Miller dress, which is normally a thousand dollar dress, that I get to rent. It was $25 off the first time renting. Normally, you rent it for 90 bucks, but I had $25 off my first time renting, so I rented it for four days. Um, for $65, and um, not only do they give you one dress for that price, but you get a backup dress meal too as well. So I got a 10 and an 8. I really don't know what size I'm going to be. I'm hoping neither one of those are too big. Um, but yeah, I can't wait to be decked out and gorgeous with my husband in a suit, a tuxedo, and me in a ball gown dress by Nicole Miller. She's one of the designers. Um, I'm so excited and I'm going to post tons of pictures and video clips if I remember to and I'm singing the Star Spangled Banner for the event so I wanted to look snazzy. Um, that's the 21st. Today is the 9th or 10th. Shame on me. And my computer's going to die. I should probably plug it in. I will go. I keep rambling. I'm sure this is probably like 9 minutes long by now. Um, talk to you guys later.